I'm Marianne Cushy, and this is your morning update for Wednesday, March 23rd. In North County, two people were killed in an early morning car accident. It happened northbound 5 near La Costa Avenue in Carlsbad. This was about 3 o'clock this morning. The crash involved several vehicles, including one that rolled over. All lanes of the northbound 5 were shut down for hours. At least two people were also hurt. Police are investigating what appears to be a fatal base jumping accident. This is in University City. A man died after jumping from an apartment building near UTC. It happened at about 1030 last night. Right now, it's not certain if the man lived in the Palisade apartments or how he may have gotten up there. The man did have a helmet and a parachute on. Investigators are trying to figure out what went wrong. This morning, we now know who the county supervisors appointed as new interim sheriff. The job fills the vacancy left after former Sheriff Bill Gore retired last month. The board named Assistant Sheriff Anthony Ray to serve until a new sheriff is sworn in in January. Ray has worked for the department for 30 years. During that time, he worked in patrol as well as detentions. Ray will be officially sworn in on April 5th. Today, you might encounter less traffic on your southbound commute on the 5 Freeway. A new nine-mile stretch of carpool lanes opens up today, covering exits from Carlsbad all the way to Solana Beach. Caltrans says the new lanes will improve traffic flow, reduce greenhouse gas emissions, and provide more travel options. Those new carpool lanes will be open 24-7 solely for motorists traveling with one or more passengers or those with valid HOV stickers. Also, today you can have a say in what's to come in the expansion of one of our county's premier parks. This evening, the Port of San Diego invites you to voice your input on three plans for expansion of National City's Pepper Park. Tonight's virtual meeting, 6 p.m., and you can find the invite at portofsandiego.org. Now let's get a look at our first alert weather. Here's Sheena. We have a very hot day in store today. Mid 80s at the coast near 90 inland. So if you're wondering, these temperatures are around 15 to 18 degrees above normal for this time of the year on average. And as we head through the rest of the week, we're going to continue to see unseasonably warm weather today. It's because of the Santa Ana offshore winds. So for the inland valleys, right around 90 would put some areas at a record high. Even for the coast, we could see some record high temperatures, but we will be seeing some changes as we head into the weekend. So after today, because today again, the hottest day of the week, we will start to cool back down into the weekend. Potential rain chance early next week, Marion. Thanks, Sheena. And of course, you can get the latest news right here at NBC7.com and on TV. And you can also learn more on our podcast, that's Today in San Diego, where we talk about the day's biggest headlines in less than five minutes. Stay safe, everybody, and have a great day.